Okay, today guys, I'm going to show you my Seagulls Model Extra 260. Uh, it's a 60 inch wingspan. I just put this one together. It was a good kit, man. It, it's solid. Everything worked really good. Um, I got a YS120 in here, and I'm running the straight pipe on it. And it fit in the cow really nice. Uh, does, I don't have very much cut out here. Um, I'm running a 16 inch, a 16 by 6 prop. Um, the canopy, um, it's got two thumb screws here and it locks into the front and uh, so that makes it nice and the kit, is, like I said, it was really good. It had everything that I needed, uh, didn't have no problems with it. It's nice and solid. Uh, the fuel tank come with it was good. Um, I'm running JR821 servos all the way around. And I put pull pull on the rudder, and I got two elevators on the back, dual elevators. And when I put this plane together, they were saying five and a half inches, which is center of your wing spar as the um, center of gravity. But I I went four and a half at first, and I'm still liking that right now. Um, I can always come back a little bit more. I actually, uh, to get a little more um, tail weight, I had to actually put my battery in the back. And, um, I and I've still got one in the front and one in the back. I'm running dual batteries on this one, six volt batteries. And I got dual switches. But I did that just for a little bit more tail weight because she was coming out a little nose heavy with this YS120. But, um, so I would do that if, if you're, you know, to start with maybe go four and a half inches, um, on your CG. But other than that, man, this is a great flying plane. It's not really 3D. Um, it can 3D. Uh, it's got enough power. But, I mean, it, it really is an aerobatic plane. It really does that really, really nice. Now she will prop hang. I've had it to uh, prop hang a little bit, so I'm still playing with it. So let's go flyer once. I think I got it rich.
Yeah. 